Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to install Privy on Shopify. A big part of any marketing campaign should be your email activity. Maximizing the size of your email list means you'll have a wider list of customers to market to. Privy provides your store with a targeted, customized email sign-up pop-up. While you may be reluctant to add pop-ups to your store, when done well and targeted at the right customers, an email registration pop-up like this can perform well. Privy allows you to target pop-ups based on certain user actions, offer discount codes, and even target only certain visitors. So let us use Privy in the run-up on building your email list. Before we start, you need to have an account in Privy first and you need to have a pop-up campaign set up. If you haven't done it yet, then you might want to do it first. We have a tutorial for that. Check the link in the description. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. To install Privy on Shopify, you need to sign in to your account on Shopify. And in your Shopify admin, click the Apps section located on the left side. On the Apps page, click the Visit Shopify App Store button. On the App Store, search for Privy on the search field located on the upper right. On the Privy page, click the green Get button. It will give you a prompt that you're about to install Privy. Just click the Install App button to start the installation. If you have a couple of campaigns set up, then this installation might take a while. Shopify will direct you to the Campaigns on Privy website. If you're not signed in, then it will ask you to sign in first. This is where you can view your pop-up campaigns. After the installation, Privy will automatically launch your pop-up campaign as long as this campaign is active. If you check your Shopify apps, you can already see that Privy is already installed. Now let us verify if the pop-up is working. On my end, I have my Shopify store open. This was open before Privy was installed. Now, I will open this page in a private window. As you can see that I already have two hanging tabs. One is located on the top left of the page and the other one is located on the top right. Remember, this is just for tutorial purposes. Do not place your tab on where it covers one of your website features like this one. I have it set in a way that it will trigger if you have scrolled 50% of the page. It actually triggered earlier, so I guess it won't trigger anymore. The pop-up will also trigger when you click the tab. Each of my tabs has corresponding campaign. You can place as many campaigns on your website just make sure that you won't be blocking any links or feature that your site have. If it'll come a time that you want to remove your pop-up campaigns in Privy because you want to switch to a different company, then all you need is to uninstall Privy. To uninstall Privy, on your Shopify admin page, click the app section located on the left side, click the trash button, in line with Privy. Although it's optional, I recommend that you give them a feedback before you completely uninstall them. Then, click the red uninstall button to completely uninstall it. You will then receive a green callout indicating that Privy has been successfully uninstalled on your Shopify account. So those are the basics that you need to know in installing your Privy account with Shopify. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. 
You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.agency and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!